Seen that intro? You, you like that? I know you heard the beginning boy said. I ain't gonna repeat her name, you know what I'm saying? I ain't even... Y'all seen the intro, y'all like that intro. Let me know if you like the intro. Ready it one through ten in the comments, you feel me? What's good, Swan again? You know what name is T Swans we back for another video, you feel me? I think I said that all wrong, but it's alright. This video is not gonna be long at all. It's kinda easy, you feel me? It just takes patience. But look, shout out to my boy Corey. Oh, it's Gory up next, you feel me? Gory up next. Shout out to you, my guy. If y'all wanna shout out, make sure that y'all comment down a video idea for me or comment down your problems with your dreads or just life problems in general. I'll make a video on it and I'ma shout you out, you feel me? I got y'all, bro. You help me, I help you. But my boy said, how do I get my dreads to hang straight and not out? I'm guessing that you got shorter dreads, so I'ma explain this quick, you know what I'm saying? They're almost at your length, but they still do their own thing well they almost like right here okay so i don't know it's either if you melanated bro i don't know because they should be hanging by the time they get like right here no cap but i'm gonna explain a little bit you know what i'm saying this is what helped me probably don't sleep with a do-rag go ahead copy your do-rag i'm gonna have the ad of the do-rag in the bonnet towards the end so if y'all want to know where to get them from for a discount watch towards the end of the video go ahead and get you a do-rag make sure that you sleep with a do-rag on if you can't afford a do-rag sleep with your hood on bro just sleep with your hood on just like this just like this, you know what I'm saying? See how they automatically lay down? Now, mine's is too long, so I don't really need to do it. But sleep with a hood on, sleep with something that covers up your head, right? Or a bonnet, you know what I'm saying? I would prefer a do-rag if your dress is smaller, but yours is longer, so. I don't know, bro, I would say a hood for real, or you could still sleep with a bonnet. No, no, a do-rag, sleep with it. All right, for you, just sleep with a do-rag on, bro. You sleep with a do-rag. But when you put on your do-rag, pull the dress down, because as soon as you put on your do-rag, your dress is gonna be like this at the roots. You know what I'm saying? Which is automatically forcing this one to be like this. Say the do-rag is right here, this is what you will do. You will pull it down, pull the dread down just like this. So you will sleep and it automatically like that. So when you take it out, it just stay down, you feel me? Another thing to do is when you wash your hair, just let it be, don't retwist it, you know what I'm saying? Or it could be the way you retwist your hair, whoever's doing it, because many people, they get their dreads retwisted, they put the front ones in the back so it automatically head towards the back, but when they want to lay down, it sticks up because it's so used to being back, you feel me? So when you retwist your locks, bro, make sure that they twist them facing down or clip them down, you know what I'm saying? Don't clip them back, don't clip them to the side, clip them down. That's really it, bro. It's not really that much to it, you feel me? I'm, I'm thinking, I don't really think it's that much to it. If y'all got something else, let him know, bro. Let me know, let him know. You could wet your hair a lot too. Don't You ain't gotta wet the roots all the time. Your dress is longer just for you, you know what I'm saying? Your locks is longer, so you could just wet like right here, you feel me? And they'll lay down as they put a little weight on them, you feel me? Or, worst case scenario, that don't work, bro. This is what you gotta do. Wet your hair, right? Get you a crochet needle. Go to the roots of your locks. I don't really recommend this, but if you really want your hair to lay down, make sure that someone that knows what they're doing is doing this. Because I messed up my dress. They both fell out. These two fell out, but I fixed them. I put them back together, and we're good. This is what you'll do. Take the crochet needle. Twist your hair, right? Twist the lock. And when you crocheting it, make sure that you laying the dread down as you crocheting it so it gets stuck. Not stuck, but it'll stay like this, you feel me? Because if you crocheting like this and all this and going all around, it's going to be like this. Like, it's going to stick out like usual. That's what some of my dreads do now. Like, this one was doing that before, but I laid it out to the side. And this one was most definitely, it was like this before. As y'all can see, it's still kind of doing it now, but I just let it be. But when you do your crochet, make sure that you pull the dread down and then, you know what I'm saying, put it through there or twist it. Lay it down, put it through there as you still laying it down, you feel me? But that's all I really had to say. I don't think it's really nothing else. It's kind of easy, quick fix. You may have to just wait till your dress get longer. They may not have a lot of weight to them, you feel me? Not saying this is a lot of weight on my head, but it got a little something to it, you feel me? It got a little... I don't know, bro. I can't explain it. It's hair, so it's not heavy, but it's hair, so it's not that hard for it to lay down, you feel me? All right, hopefully y'all did enjoy the video. Make sure you like, comment if you're new, subscribe. Comment more videos y'all want me to do and I'll shout you out for sure. I'm not missing no shout outs, bro. And yeah, that's all I really had to say. Rate the intro one through 10 in the comments once again. But yeah, that's all I gotta say. I'ma see y'all next video. Swanley game, no game. We out. Thank you, Swanley.